Hello, um, this is Smiley and this is Happy. Okay, that's my sister's dog, not mine. Um, so, uh, welcome back to my channel. So, uh, I went uh, fishing uh, in San Francisco Bay last week and uh, I didn't catch uh, any legal uh, halibut. Um, I caught five uh, um, uh, uh, shakers, so I couldn't do a video for you guys. So sorry about that. You know, um, making a, a, a YouTube a fishing YouTube video is a, is a very uh, uh, very difficult sometimes. You know, you spend a lot of hours of fishing and then editing and everything. But when you go fishing, you cannot catch fish. Then you cannot do a video. So uh, instead of doing the fishing video today, um, I'm going to show you uh, how to uh, tie. Uh, how to tie uh, uh, tie a, a kayak on top on top of a, a truck, uh, a van, a SUV. Okay, so I'm going to show you that. Uh, uh, I've seen a lot of people don't know how to uh, tie a kayak on top of a of a car. Um, so I'm going to show you uh, with a rope. Okay, it's more special. It's, it's with, with a rope. Um, so. Um, uh, uh, thank you for watching and if you like the uh, video, can you please uh, subscribe and like my video. Thank you so much. Hi, um, welcome back to uh, my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to um, uh, tie a kayak on top of the roof of the car um, using rope. Instead of using this, it's, it's very easy, very simple. Um, I'm going to show you how to tie a kayak um, with the rope, okay? So, uh, can you please come in? So, I'm, I'm, I'm going to zoom it in for you so uh, you can see, okay? So, um, at the end, uh, over here, I'm going to do a, a bowling knot, okay? There's a, there's a two way for you to do a bowling. You can do it right around here. You can do it right here, okay? This is what you need to do. You, you have a loop. It's right here, you see? You have a loop. You loop a short uh, end is in front. A long end is on behind. Okay, like this. And then you put the short end under here, around here. This is how you do a bowling knot, okay? You go through here, you go through the hole, and then you go from left to right behind, like this. You go behind this this long end, okay? You go you go through the loop, okay? You go around behind, and then you go back this 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 loop here, okay? And then you tie it, okay? Like this. This is the bowling. Okay, the bowling knot. The reason you do this knot because it's very easy to untie. Okay, when you're done, all you have to do, you turn around here, right here, you break it like this. See, all you have to do, break it like this, it's very easy, and then you can untie your bowling knot. Okay, so I'm gonna do one more time for you. What you have to do is, is two ends, the long the long end and the short one. So what you do is you twist like this. So the long end is behind. This is the short end, okay? You put the short end right here through this this uh, ball on your roof, okay? And then you go through the loop behind from left to right, like this. See it? And then you go through the hole. And then you tie it. OK? 
cat. This is a bowling, a bowling knot. You see it? Okay, so we have one end right here. Okay, and then you threw the lie over there and you will tie over there. Okay guys, so now I'm going to uh, I'm going to tie it over here this end. Okay, so um over here I'm going to I'm going to share with you how to uh, tie it over here using a trucker knot. Okay, the trucker knot is a very important knot that uh, that uh, you know, we can use everyday life. Um a lot of people um uh, don't know how to use this knot. So I'm going to share with you today. It's very important to tie down uh, um, things that are on top of your car, your SUV, your van. Okay, so the the the, the trucker knot. This is what you need to tie. Okay, you want to put uh, it's on top of here. You want to twist your line a couple times like this. See, it's very simple. And you put this line. You hold it like this. You fold it. You put it through. See it? You put it through. And it become a slipping knot. You see it? Become a slipping knot. And then at this end over here. Okay, this end. You you want to put this end through here. And then you put this end over this slipping knot right here see it and then what you have to do pull it okay when you use the trucker knot right here it it it, it, it increase the power of pulling instead of one person pulling it will be become a two people pulling this this line okay like this and then right here you use your uh you you use your finger to hold it right here and then you make a It's just a symbol overhand, okay? Like this. Okay? And then you can do one more time. Okay? So it's, it's, it's very tight, like this. Okay, guys? That's, that's uh, one end. And then we're going to do the other end. Okay guys, so I'm going to do one more time, this, this end, so you can see, okay? What you have to do, you have to, to do a bowling, bowling knot. What you have to do is, there's uh, two, two, uh, two ends, the short end and the long end, okay? What you have to do, you put the, the long end behind, you see it? The long end behind the short end, okay? And then, you're going to put this one, this end over this. See it? You put this end through the loop, the hole right here, and you go behind. Okay, you see it? You go behind. From left to right, and you go back into this, this loop right here. Okay, and you pull it. See it? It's a bowling line, bowling knot. Okay? So it doesn't matter how hard, you pull, right? All you have to do is you turn around right here, you break it. See it? You break it like this, and then you can untie it very easily. Okay? I'm going to do one more time for you. Okay? The short end, the long end. Yeah, all you have to do is twist it like this. Okay? So the long end is on the back, the, the short end is on the front. And you put the short end through this. Then you go through the hole. Okay. You go behind from the left to the right. And then you go back here. Okay. See it? This is a bowling knot. It's a very important knot. Okay. This knot can, can tie to one end. But when you're done, it's very easy to untie. That's why I use the... The, the bowling knot, okay? So, I'm done with, with one end, so I'm going to do the other end, okay? I'm going to throw the rope over there, and then I tie 
over that side. Okay, guys. So over here, I will show you earlier. Okay, I'm gonna do a trucker knot. Okay, you twist a couple times, right? And put this, fold it, put it through like this. So you have a a loop right here. Okay. So I'm gonna put this one through this ball right here. Okay. And then I put this through this uh, loop right here. And then I'm gonna pull it like this. See it? Pull it down, hold it right here, and then you tied it with a symbol overhand knot, okay? And then you tie one more time right here. Okay, so it's, it's, it's very tight, right? Now, I'm gonna show you one more thing. It make it even tighter, okay? You see, if you have the extra, extra rope, right? So you use this extra rope right here, This extra rope, you see you have the loop right here. You see, this loop, you put your line through here, the extra one. Okay, all you have to do, you go like this, you tie it. See it? You can tie it right here. So, it, it creates more tension, tension on both ends. Okay, it's even, it's even stronger. Okay, you do like this, right? This is what you need to do, okay? And then you tie it right here. But I'm not, I'm not stopping right here for you. I'm going to show you uh, one more trick that you can make it even tighter, okay? Right here. So the camera go over here, please, okay? What you have to do, create the trucker knot right here. See it? Create a trucker knot right here. See it? So you have the loop right here and then and then your line will go through here. Okay. If you, you if you don't have this this uh, this uh, loop right here, you can go through right here. Okay. You can go through right here. Since you have the loop right here, I, I'm going to use the loop. Okay. Right here. You go right here, and then you go one more time through this this loop right here. And then you tie it. When you do this, you increase. You you increase. You double the the, the pulling force. You see it? You can pull like this. Right here. And finally, you tie it right here. Okay, it's a symbol overhand. Okay, like that. And maybe one more time. You see guys, just a symbol, a symbol knot from here to here. It create a lot of tension. So your kayak here, you see it? I cannot even, I cannot even move it. So it's, it's a very tight, okay? So that's how you tie a kayak on top of your roof of a car, a truck, an SUV, or a van. Okay, guys? So thank you so much for uh, watching. If you like the video, can you please like and subscribe? Thank you.